Hey you guys, it's SD again. Getting ready to rain here pretty soon. Had a few sprinkles come down here. Got the roof installed on the uh, shed. It's going to house the uh, solar and wind generator equipment. Installed the battery box that I made. Came out 25 inches wide by 80 inches long. I'll be able to get uh, 20 batteries in there. That'll give me over uh, 2,250 amps worth of uh, use out of the batteries. Made the front door. Got that hung. Got the hinges and stuff on there. Let's see if we can go inside here. There's the uh, battery box. I put a two inch filter piece here on the back side here. That way when this door tilts up, it'll sit there without having to have anything prop it up, but I'll still put some sort of little hook latch up there. And I went ahead and uh, cut out the uh, vent hole. That's like two and three eighths outside diameter uh, ABS pipe there, or schedule 40, one of the two. Picked it up down at Lowe's. I'll put a, uh, after I cut those off flush, I'll go ahead and secure them on there and uh, fill around any little small gaps and um, put a computer fan blown out on one and on this other one will be a, one uh, pulling air in. On the outside edges there, I'll take some of this uh, trim that's left over. It's like four and a half inches. End up cutting it square, drilling a hole in the center and uh, mounting that on there to cover up the uh, holes on the outside of the shed before I put, put them on there. I'll put uh, some window screen over the hole and use the uh, white block there to hold it in place. That way nothing can crawl in and out of there. But it should come out all right. Anyway, it's been a long process. Uh, I've got a backing panel that I'm gonna put up on the wall over here. It's gonna house the controller inverters and any other meters I might want. Up on this upper section there, at the top of the stud uh, up there I'm gonna uh, run a couple of two by fours across and put like a 30 inch uh, deep piece of plywood across there for storage and then I've got a uh, 12 volt light that I'm gonna be hooking up there a little later, little later on so it's getting there maybe tomorrow I can get that panel and then the shelf inside there and then I'll go ahead and start wiring up but it's waterproof roof now everything's done up there on the trim getting there uh -oh. I even put a little hasp on the uh, battery box that way I'm the only one that's going in there so I'll have the same uh, three locks that uh, one key fits all of them so that should take care of the problem here let give you a look and see what it looks like from a little bit farther away it's getting there, and it's going to be construction cleanup time. All right, we'll see you guys.